Hey guys, it's me Monica, and today I'm going to be doing a book review about this book I finished last night. I could have finished it sooner, but I've been like really busy doing tons of other stuff. So, but the book I'm going to be doing the review on is called A Work in Progress by Connor Franto. This book is basically a memoir about Connor's life, even though he has only spent 22 years on this world. So that's why it's called a work in progress, because there's still life to live. There's st still more ups and downs in the future to come. And I found this book really inspiring. Like, okay, so... Okay, so... From the chapter called In Retrospect, which is the first chapter, to... Tell um the fault on her scars. So wait, so I mean in retrospect to the chair, um the chair of the chapter. But um the last like one the last nineteen chapters of this book are really inspiring. Not saying the whole book is inspiring. But the first half of the book is just about, like, Connor's life and stuff. And then the second half is all about, like, inspiring and telling you, uh, tell, like, tons of expire, ins expiring, inspiring quotes. Um, by far, I think my favorite chapter, maybe, if I can find it. Okay, some of my favorite chapters, um... Okay, I mean, I might, it might spoil it for you guys if you haven't read them. If you will not, if you won't spoil it. Okay, the first chapter that I really like is called The Fault on Our Scars. It's just, okay, The Fault on Our Scars, it's just like, it's, in part, it's explaining to you. How Connor got his like little bump on his face, and then also it's saying that we all carry scars to deal to we we all carry scars. We just have to deal with it. It may not be on the outside, it may be on the inside, meaning like depression stuff like that. It's like a scar. And we just have to learn to deal with it. And it, like really, really like freaking inspired me. It's like a really awesome book. So, like I said, I'm just going to show you, tell you guys some of my favorite chapters. So, the first, um, letters from my parents. An anxious boy in his plastic crown. Vintage. My arm. You'll learn what that's about. Creativity. The fault in our scars. Quaffle. Numb to the numbers. Um, the problem with labels, a person worth like, ignoring your phone for, live now, worry later, respect to my elders, it gets better really, leap of faith, getting to know myself, the myth of fame, and life doesn't wait. Like, this book is a 212 page book, but if... We can, you can really finish it in like a day or so. I could have, but I've been like really busy with lots of reading, lots of like stuff. Not that bad. And it's a really awesome book. I'll read the um, back of it to you guys if you haven't had, haven't looked. If you haven't read it or checked it out. It says, I'm just a small town kid trying to figure out my place in the big wide world. I've only been around for 22 years. And there's so much left for me to explore and learn. And then... But the photography in this book, it's like, it's like amazing. Look at that. And then, I'll just show you guys a picture real quickly. Like, mm, there's so many, like, good, like, awesome looking like you know. Looking like you know. There's so many awesome cool pictures in here. Like that one. Mm. 
do that one. These two. And it's kind of, there's like a lot of stuff to find out about Connor in his book. And if you're going like through some rough patches in your life, like problems and like anxiety, depression, etc. You can pick this book up. You don't have to read about his life or anything. You can just like flip through the pages whenever you need it. Like flip through the chapters. Like if you're feeling sad one day, just go straight, like open the book and go like to like the chapter called Where I Found Happiness. Or whatever you guys, whatever you feel like is really like, you know, needed for you that day. And then do like one of the things he says that gives him, makes him feel happy. I'll just you see a part. Um, but yeah, that's Connor Fanta's book. Check it out if you have not. And check out his YouTube channel called Connor Fanta. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of the day. Peace out, baby. Have a great rest of the day. Peace out, baby unicorns. Bye.